Out here we are reading the hand of Bhupendra Singh Hudda and uh, he is the uh, he was the chief minister of Haryana India uh, from 2004 to 2014 so for a very long period he has been the chief minister and uh, his hand appears to be very good right now. His age is approximately 70. And uh, his father was uh, a very big freedom fighter. Uh, so you just analyze his hand. Uh, generally, people think that if you have a Y or a M or a V, then everything is good or, or a, just a fish sign then everything is going to be very good in your hand. So, uh, see, we, we do have to give a little bit importance to these signs, but uh, you don't see any such sign on this particular hand. So, in spite of having no such sign, uh, still people can rise up to very high positions. Uh, what is more necessary is, uh, there are many more things that are necessary. Uh, and... Uh, uh, that would give you a result, not just having a few letters written or you are trying to just make out somehow that you see a M on your hand. A M doesn't mean purely like uh, you you would make more of money. I would try to explain to you uh, how and who can make more money in their life. Uh, see, there's only one request from you. Uh, that uh, do click on the advertisement you see on this particular video. Uh, this will help me to make a very small amount of money and this is going to motivate me to make more and more of videos. Uh, I will just explain to you people who are learning palmistry that, uh, uh, that uh, the correct way to see a palm is to see how good we are at handling situations and how good we are handling money and people. So for that we, we see the structure of the hand. By structure we mean the bone structure, uh, the skin covering over uh, your bones uh, and the padding over, over uh, these particular areas all over the palm. If there's a good padding it automatically means that the person possesses uh, the, the qualities of, of the mounts uh, and each mount represents few few qualities like this one is politics and religion and administration. This is the area of uh, beauty and art and uh, energy levels and vitality, stamina. This is the area of memory. This is the area of technical skills, communication skills, business skills. So all these things should be present. So these are the areas we need to concentrate on. If if the structure of the hand is good, as we see on this particular hand, it automatically means that the person would be able to handle very difficult situations in his life and the person would not uh, uh, would not uh, uh, like uh, cow down and uh, uh, the person would remain in relevance. He is having lots of cases against him like uh, uh, CBI name uh, Bhupinder Singh Hudda, main conspirator in 1000 crore Manisa land scam. So, so for that, uh, we see if the heart line, if the heart line is singular, it automatically means that the person would be able to handle stress, handle stress very well. These people, basically, uh, in times of uh, problems, uh, they do not get afraid and. Uh, uh, the heart functioning is perfect and uh, nothing happens to them. However big the challenge or however big the problem there might be, still these people, they never ever uh, get stressed up. So a person who never gets stressed automatically it's get converted into, uh, into success. Uh, and uh, these people would always be successful in their life. Uh, uh, however difficult circumstances it, they would come out of it uh, untouched. So, so this is a beautiful sign to have the heart line you are seeing deep and clear. That's a beautiful sign. There shouldn't be too many branches over it. 
too many branches basically reduces the quality. If the line is very thick, again the quality uh, is finished or if the heart line has got many island egg formation or the heart line is something like this, again those are not good signs to have. Uh, they would build up stress in a person's life and the heart line is starting under the finger of Saturn. Saturn is the finger for wisdom. Saturn is the finger for materialism. Saturn is the finger where the person is more responsible. Uh, see, it all depends who the person is responsible towards. If a person is re responsible towards himself, the person becomes selfish. If a person is responsible towards the people who have elected him, then he's uh, uh, then the person is basically responsible responsible towards a community or, or a state. So uh, it all depends who you target towards, you basically get results from there. All over the hand, we see fewer lines over the palm, automatically these people uh, would not be distracted, highly focused. For focus, we see the heart line. If the heart line is distinct and clear, it automatically means that a person is likely to uh, be highly focused. People who lack focus have these kind of lines and those are not good. And uh, the other thing to see is like he's aged 70. So 70, the person is likely uh, going downhill. But if the hand shows strength, uh, it automatically means that the person would remain active even after the age of 70. So these people are highly energetic people and uh, uh, and uh, they basically give love and take love in e equal measure because Venus basically is for energy levels and uh, uh, his uh, date of birth is 15th September 1947. So the main number is 15 that the number of Venus 1 plus 5 is 6, so 6 is the number of Venus. So Venus is highly important in his palm. Uh, we don't see even, uh, probably the quality of uh, image is not perfect. Uh, if, if there's an upward line, basically it means that a person rises up to a high position. But here we, it appears we don't see, but there could be that, that line over here. And, uh, uh, but we see a good padding over here. So this basically means a person does have a very good, uh, very good administrative skills or political skills. And uh, we, we do see that the fourth finger is quite long. It is crossing the third fingers, uh, third fi ring fingers, ring fingers. This is a ring finger, ring fingers, first phalange. It means uh, the person is uh, good at communication, good at communicating uh, what, and they are able to project their uh, ideas or communicate, they can communicate really good uh, in front of the public. So, so and uh, that's it for this particular reading. Thank you for watching.